Hello and welcome to our Python basics section. So first of all, let's um, open a brand new Python 3 Jupyter Notebook. And in the next uh, lessons, we will build the fundamentals where you can learn everything that is uh, required to work with and solve our real world problems later on. So almost all of the concepts um, that we will learn here in the Python basics section, we will need and apply later in our comprehensive case studies. So this is um, the good thing in, on our real world simulation case studies that more or less any important concept of basics Python uh, can be applied there. And we all know that the learning effect is best when we are working on real world projects. So in the Python basics section, we are working exclusively with um, the Python standard library. So that means um, that with all functions that are by default included in the Python basic installation. And uh, later in our course, we will import and work with um, the add-on package NumPy, which is a very powerful and useful tool when it comes to scientific and large numeric computations. And also we will work with um, the matplotlib library for making visualizations and plots. Now there are actually hundreds or thousands of add-on packages out there and um, this is why Python is so popular because for every task in particular in the data science stack there are many open source add-ons which uh, makes uh, life in Python quite easy. So by working with uh, these add-ons, we do not have to reinvent the wheel every time by developing our code from scratch uh, with uh, basic Python tools. However, if you want to work serious and successful in Python, so knowing the basics and being able to work with uh, the Python standard library tools is uh, nevertheless essential. So there are actually no shortcuts and yeah, however, it's fun and interesting to work um, with basic and essential coding structures and you learn a lot. So I hope to see you in the next sessions. Bye.